the NBC 26 Precision Forecast Center. Meteorologist Brian Nisnansky. All right, we're starting to see the rain wind down across the area this morning. Probably another hour or two with some showers in the area, especially our southeastern locations. Now, rain totals uh, anywhere from around a quarter of an inch uh, to three quarters of an inch for most, but these totals are climbing, and some of these reports are a little bit old, so you may have a little bit more than that. Uh, eight tenths of an inch in Ripon, Manitowoc, 71, one hundredths of an inch of rain, four tenths in Appleton, uh, two tenths of rain in Sturgeon Bay. So you'll notice the farther north and the farther west you go, uh, the rain totals get a little bit lighter. All right, on the precision satellite and radar this morning, mainly right, light rain now here in northeastern Wisconsin, but it gets uh, heavier down towards uh, Fond du Lac and Sheboygan. Notice the clearing all right in northwestern Wisconsin. We'll start to see some sun around midday and into this afternoon. A little closer look on the precision radar. Again, mainly sprinkles here now from Green Bay and Appleton and to the west and uh, just some light rain from Manitowoc and you can see it gets heavier down towards Fond du Lac and especially over towards Sheboygan now. You can see that uh, area of yellow and orange indicating a moderate to heavier rainfall this morning. Now behind this rain, another little blast of chill here as we head into uh, this weekend. We're looking at a chilly uh, Mother's Day weekend. A second cold front arrives as we head into tomorrow morning. More on that in a second. Currently outside is 38, so chilly this morning. Also windy. Winds are out of the north northeast in Appleton at 23 miles per hour with a current temperature of 37. So as we look down College Avenue, still some wet pavement out there, but the rain is for the most part coming to an end in the Fox Cities. All right, across northeastern Wisconsin, 37 in Shawano, 39 in Wapaka, 41 uh, this morning in Manitowoc. And notice the cold air uh, driving in here from the north, still hanging on to uh, 45 in Chicago. Chicago and 60 in Peoria, but look at International Falls at 29 degrees. So as we look at the temperature trend, way below normal these next four days, but then we quickly rise well above normal uh, by Tuesday and Wednesday. We could be back to around 80 degrees. Let's go through the forecast highlights. We'll start to see some clearing by this afternoon, expecting lots of sun, still windy and cool through the day. We'll look for another quick round of showers tomorrow morning with another cold front. Uh, we could actually see maybe a little bit of sleet or ice pellets mixing in tomorrow morning as well and then windy and chilly over these next few days. Here's the Midwestern satellite and radar. And you can see again the clearing in northwestern Wisconsin. We're going to look for again a brief period of sunshine as we head into this afternoon. We'll go through precision cast here. Our storm system quickly races off to the east. Here's 8 o'clock in the evening. We have mainly clear skies. And here comes that second cold front again, giving us a pretty good chance of showers tomorrow morning. And maybe again a few, a uh, little bit of sleet or ice pellets mixing in. And by Saturday afternoon, we should be in the clear and Mother's Day. Uh, overall looks dry, but again, it's looking uh, chilly and also windy uh, this weekend. All right, your forecast for today, light rain ending, windy and becoming mostly sunny, a high of 56 for tonight, a low of 39, partly cloudy. And here's your seven day. Look at the lows on uh, Sunday morning and then also Monday morning around freezing. So if you planted your flowers already, again, you may want to Look out uh, those mornings, uh, cover them up. Again, do that trick where you soak them in water uh, before, not soak them in water, but take out your hose before you go to bed and uh, you're going to give them a good shot of water that will keep the soil temperature and air temperature near uh, the flowers a little bit up, a couple degrees. It's like you do this for a living. Yeah, you know, <laughs> the old green thumb, I got it, that's right. <laughs> but you know, it quickly turn around, 80 degrees by Tuesday and Wednesday. I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> up and down with the temperatures, yes. Time to check in now with Ted's.